what we did today was a little bit different than what would really happen in reality, but this is just a chance to not only give our guys a chance to go out and work with uh, IEDs and, and real world scenarios, but get uh, these, the local PD and the sheriff's office a chance to get out and work with EOD techs. We have similar procedures, whether we're Army EOD or ATF or local bomb squad. We've got a lot of similar things we can do, so this helps benefit them as well to get them out and learn how how to work with IED related scenarios and having access to an actual bomb squad. Down with the, the, the day we did some active shooter training with the, the National Guard Army and the local sheriff, the Beaufort County Sheriff's Department and the Washington Police Department and the fire service. Over the last few years that, um, that I've been here, we've really forged that connection to know that they are really an asset for us if we need them. And the cool thing about being National Guard, um, you know, we're, we're part of the community here. So we, once we start getting in with these guys and we start learning all their lingos, that's a relationship and, a, and a, an understanding something that can be continued on. Really, I feel really, really good about the way the guys and the young ladies performed today. Um, we wouldn't be able to do it without the help of the local EOD unit here in Beaufort County because we don't have that type of asset in, in our department.